What's up guys, welcome to Top Home For You. Uh, today I'm gonna show you the easy way to get your Google app and Google services uh, installed. No need for a USB or uh, a PC, so just a straightforward install and uh, you're up and running. So uh, if you wanna see uh, my other video, how I install all these apps uh, without the need of uh, Google Play Store, you can just uh, check my other video i'll leave a link in the description below uh, and um, for you to have a look but this uh, will run uh, the play store on the huawei mapad without the need uh, of uh, any uh, lz play or changing uh, firmware downgrading or anything like that so to get started uh, you just uh, need to open open the browser and then uh, just uh, go to Google and then type Vmos and then search uh, on the first link just tap on that and then uh, just uh, tap on the Vmos Pro download which would download uh, the file for you it's uh, about 730 meg so it uh, depending on your internet speed and then just tap download and then as you can see there uh, it's downloading so what this does you add another uh, virtual machine like another Android uh, system on top of your uh, MUI uh, software so you can run them side by side and choose if you want to use the full-on uh, google services you log on on this is to use all your favorite your favorite apps and uh, if you're okay using the tablet you can just shut down the other one and use it or just switch in between both uh, it will be fine Okay, that uh, has finished uh, installing. So uh, just uh, all you need to do, just uh, go through the installer. So uh, you don't need to reset or change the dates or do anything. You just, uh, you just install the app, proceed. And then done. So just close that and then find the Vmos Pro it's there. I'm just gonna open it up. I'll just uh, swipe up and uh, tap on that where it says enter Vmos Pro. Then you need to allow all these uh, to access your tablet you just click on one click on authorization then just set up and then enable the draw over the app so you just tap on that then go back then you just need to say allow 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 so uh, here, you just need to go on the top one where it says ROM 7.164 bits and then that will install the VM for you. So you're just going to install uh, the app. That's, uh, there you go. So that has been installed. Uh, it is uh, running at the moment, but as you can see, there is no Google, yeah, it's not showing. Um, but I'm just gonna show you a quick way you can switch between both. You just tap on the little widget on the corner there. Just tap on that. So it is running on there, so you just swipe up. And then you can choose. So you, that takes you back to the normal um, um, EMUI uh, 
version of the tablet if you want to switch back you just tap on the little widget in there in the corner and then tap on that and then it takes you back to away so since that installed and uh, the next thing you need to do just uh, go up and then just see on the vm setting and then you need to switch this on uh, google services from work and then confirm it So that's uh, completed fine. So you just click OK. So you need to now you need to restart the VMOS to allow it to uh, uh, upload the Google services. So just tap on the little uh, widget on the corner, and then just to restart, or you just you can just shut down, shut down, and then that will close it, and then reopen it from the icon on your home screen and then start there you go so where uh, it has loaded up now if you swipe up you can see there the google play store so just up and hold as uh, usual and then pull the, sh the icon on your and your main screen and then okay now we uh, just tap sign in and put your Gmail account to log into the system. Okay, once you put your password, you just tap next, then agree to the terms and condition, accept, and there you go, you logged in, no errors, no messages. So uh, it just uh, on the, when you first logged in, it might close itself a few times because it's still doing some updates in the background. So just go into my app. Okay, let's search for Gmail. Install. No thanks. it's installing let's go back install YouTube go back install where uh, Google classroom And Search for Chrome.
you can just uh, carry on install all your favorite app from the play store and everything should run as normal so your google classroom will work as you can see no errors is popping up nothing so you can just use it from everything is uh, working as it should Google map is working fine as you can see so everything is running fine so just go to the main screen then we'll go there. so uh, that's it so uh, as you can see that's the easiest and uh, best uh, option for you if you require uh, apps uh, that uh, must run using Google services you can just uh, swap back to go onto the main screen so uh, and whenever you want to use your favorite app with google play store you can just uh, tap on that to bring that back on or you can just tap that and then shut it down when you don't need it and then uh, use your tablet and when it comes to use uh, the other app you just uh, tap reload vmos and then you just tap on the little play button at the bottom and then that will restart the system for you and uh, you don't have to reinstall everything so it will save everything for you so uh, yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and uh, don't forget if you're new to this channel don't forget to subscribe and for more video i'll be doing uh, i'll be making more and more video uh, regarding the google services on the huawei device uh, this method will work with uh, any device as uh, if you have either a phone or, or a tablet it should work the same the procedure to install it is still the same thank you for watching and uh, i'll catch you up on the next one